I'm ready. Okay. Babies, we're back. Your platoon is what remains of recon. Holding you into the We didn't skip the flashback this time. You'll Yay. be going up that damn hill tonight. We're intelligence gathering, sir. I don't need intelligence, son. I need men who can hold rifles and kill jabs. Tonight, Jeez. you're a rifle company. We've got cooks, mechanics, and stretcher bearers all going into the line. We aim to break them tonight, Lieutenant. Nice skirt. Good to see you, Hank. You too, Cole. How's your war? Not quite what I expected. What were you expecting? I don't know. As I live, I will never get over that we'll... Hey, who's that medic? Yeah. He'll be killed going out there. It's Sheldon, the guy from the Alcala Bridge. That guy's got no fear. <laughs> that guy got no chill. <laughs> oh, geez. Now, that's just irresponsible. Clearly, that guy's gonna die, right? So don't, uh... What's up with the, like, Native American, like, music? rain dancer music going on? I don't know, it's bad. You didn't make it. I didn't go out there to save him. What are you mm -hmm. saying? I went out there to put him out of his misery. To ease his pain. Do you have a problem with that? Murder, Corbin. That's bull. Um, the I don't have a problem with that. Smell the stench. Feel the horse breath <laughs> on your neck. You need help, yes. man. Call for me tonight, Lieutenant. When you're up on that hill. I've been up there three times already. The circles of hell have nothing on Sugar Loaf Hill. Get this madman out of my sight! It was more just irresponsible for him to go into that situation because he's a medic, right? That guy was for sure going to die, so just stay out of it. Well, he wants to go there because the guy's for sure going to die, but... I understand that. Well, but... it's the setup. Well, but... But, like, he has a responsibility to not die so other people can live, right? Well, yes, that would, of course, be the the, the logical argument. The purely logical <laughs> argument would be that. The moral argument is ambiguous. You like to fight game, Phelps? There's no morals to war. In the Marines. I found that a well, I mean, experience. there are if you put them in there. Geneva Convention. Sandwich, buddy. Corn beef and egg salad, 12 cents. Corn beef and egg salad? That sounds terrible. Oh. Okay, is it boxing? It's strictly a mugs game. You'll like this fight, though. A plucky lion hmm. is about to take a beating from an up-and-coming Negro. You sound pretty sure about the result. I ought to be. Uh, I got 50 bucks on the black kid. You, you also still have that $2,000 that you never yeah. gave back. Let's get a ringside <laughs> seat. I got a ringside seat. They're everyone standing. Yeah. What do you mean you got a ringside seat? I mean you brought a chair with you because that's all you need. Man, they did not wear helmets back then. Huh? They don't wear helmets in boxing now. I mean amateur. They have those little like um. Oh, that's wrestling, huh? That's wrestling. Yeah, I guess. I mean, in amateur boxing and like martial arts competitions, where they'll have helmets on. And, uh, I mean, kids' fights will always have, like, helmets and stuff on. What's a limey? What's a limey? Is uh, that, like, guy a from, British? Yeah, it's okay. a guy from, uh, England, I guess? I don't think they call Scottish people limeys. And Kiwis, New Zealand. Do you know why they are called limeys? I thought it's because they always, like, smelled like lime because they always have limes on their ships when they're going places. Because they, they got scurvy, yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh my god, You're now. absolutely correct. Hey guys. That son of a bitch came in his jam the door. And who are you? Carlo Arcaro, I'm his manager. I'm his trainer. Interesting attitude to have towards a victorious athlete. Victorious? We had an arrangement. We had a Uh oh, who's supposed to lose? That lying yeah. bastard was paid to take a nap. He reneged. You were out of pocket? Damn right. Me and a couple hundred other people. Stand oh, aside. God. Why doesn't Phelps just go like, uh, I don't want to get involved in this. What does this have to do with drugs? To prevent him from getting Nothing. He was paid to flop. There was big money riding on So are we here because you lost money or because we're investigating a prize fighting rack? Very funny. Look around and see This guy is terrible. Your partner is so bad. Why doesn't Cole Phelps just like peace out? 
Like, this doesn't have anything to do with me by... Right? I mean, that's what I would do. Also, like, I'm sorry, this actually isn't my job. Also, what's going on with this partner and that, like, Sanders guy, right? Yeah, I don't know. It's like, it's... I don't know, man. It seems like there's stuff... Um, I'm just I, gonna do this for an hour. I don't, I don't know what's going on. I, I just wanted to do that as long as I could. Newspaper? Newspaper. Alienist Fontaine working selflessly to help the infirm. Means someone who like You look trouble. Oh, this is the psychiatrist guy. Yeah. Who does uh, gives people like morphine, doctor. right? Yeah. Can I help, Cole? Is it money? No, no, doctor. That's okay. Do I have your This guy looks tired. Whatever you say, he's got those dark drugs. rings around his drugs. eyes. Drugs. No, he was just selling drugs. Oh. I talked some of the guys in my old unit into doing something. And it's gone wrong. I guess I did it for the wrong reason. For short term gain. We came home from China. On the cool bridge. Morphine robbery. That was us. I thought I could get the guys a fair share. Some sort of benefit for the sacrifices that they made in the war. Those guys deserve it, Doctor. Oh, I'm sure they do, Court. But the deserve it aren't always rewarded. Tell me about it, Doc. Uh, we shifted our stuff onto this mob-connected guy, and it's been turning up all over town. It wasn't meant to be like this. Wait, what was it supposed to be like? I know that I'm gonna steal drugs and give it to a gang. But people are dying. Surely they won't sell it. What you... It's showing up all over town. It would be a sign of success, wouldn't it? Why is that surprising? Is this where it ties into like our actual game? This is where it starts. We're on third disc now. Mm -hmm. I don't think we actually mentioned that. So this will be... The first is, I guess, is just like kind of setting up for what the game is. Second is you kind of raising through the ranks, and now the third disc will be where the two subplots start coming together. This guy wasn't a part of the war, was he? The psychiatrist? I don't think so. No, the the other guy. The guy sitting in the chair? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was part of your unit. He was the medic. Oh. Who ran up on the hill and killed the guy? Well, they all got baby mouth. How was I supposed to know? You gotta look at the eyes. <laughs> it's about the eyes and the hair. Also, he's always wearing the same jacket, so that helps you. Well, out. I know that that's the uh, guy from the other newspaper stuff, but yeah, no, he's from the. And then remember that um, scene when they were like in an alleyway with the mob. Yeah, that was him too. Yeah, that was him. And then the private detective who was with him was also part of the uh, military mm. place. Gay stuff? Wait, what was that? It's him being weird. That was so some, you know he's like a bad guy. That was some E.T. E phone home shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's the other glove. Huh? Huh? Checking out these fucking gloves. Oh, it looks like this guy has a right and a left hand. Okay, so that, that narrows down the suspects. <laughs> it narrows down the suspects. All right, we're not looking for any one-handed man. Just pick up some sweaty jockstrap. This isn't Twin Peaks. We're not looking for one-handed men. There we go. I want to look at the other glove. Oh, I can't look at those gloves. Man, I want to look at so many gloves. There's hmm. a phone number we can run by R&I. There's a bunch of names. Ugh, my nose is stuffy. You're not the only one who likes a flutter, Roy. What's a flutter? Someone who's paid to take a dive? Sure. Ooh. Tape? I need this. For I, your hands or something? What? No, Cole Phelps needs it because he's uh, really getting into arts and crafts. Aww. Uh, scrap, you... Scrapbooking, mostly. Are you saying he made that terrible jacket? Because I can tell. No, his wife made that. That's why he's cheating on her. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, this is bad. <laughs> An open window. You know what that means. He escaped. The bugs are getting in. <laughs> Close that damn window. <laughs> There's no screen on it. 
Ooh, showers. Investigate uh, the okay. dirty towel. This is by far the grossest, like, investigation we've done. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in here. Besides, like, all the dead bodies. Let's see. Do not spit on floor. The manager seems to have left, you so I can't talk to them. Oh, no, no, no. I feel bad too, Mick, dear. He guaranteed me he would take the flop. I He's gonna get murdered just fish like Daredevil you bad. Roy, you out of pocket too? Mickey, Mickey. seems that way. Worry, Except you still have like. My boys are out looking for him. Well, you'd better call them off. This is a police matter now. If anything happens to Hammond, I'll testify that you made threats against him. Good. Who's the Greyhound? He's a frisky one, isn't he? Cole Phelps. Mickey Cohen. I know who he is, Roy. I uh met his brother in law. That music. Is he is his cousin in the war or something like that? No. Uh he was part of a different investigation. I forget exactly what the investigation was, but we either killed or put his brother in prison. Staff only. Go to the telephone. No, I'm just gonna run around. We Oh god, the inversion is still fucking with me. Um, just change it. Why don't you just play? You don't play? Well, I keep fucking up, though. Well, I mean, whose fault is that? Maybe you need to play more to get better. I guess so. Yeah, you play. I'm just gonna sit back, relax, and quietly masturbate while we watch L.A. <laughs> Noir. 1247. Yeah, see, he says 1247 now. But the other time he said... Um, 1247. Yeah. I need an address for the following phone number. AL345. The address for the phone number is... The Hotel El Mar, 6294 Leland Way, Hollywood. Thanks for your help. How is just getting the address helpful? You go there? Yeah, but, like, you don't have GPS or anything. Maps don't normally, like, have the address written down anywhere. This is the car, right? You know the way. You can drive. <laughs> you American know Legion Stadium Flophouse. is where you were. Quarter a night, no questions asked. You seem to have a pretty cozy relationship. So far, none of your partners have been likable. No. Do I know the hint of reprimand in your tone, detective? Talking to gangsters comes with the turf. You should try out Mickey's place. He's got a haberdasher's up on Sunset. See if he can get you out of those old man's clothes that you slink around in. Oh, you're one to talk. It's a front for his illegal activities. It is that, but he does carry some very sharp suits. If it's okay with you, I'll stick with Brooks Brothers. Brooks Brothers. Mm, Brooks Brothers. Nice name drop, Phelps. <laughs> if you don't mind, I'll stick with Gucci. Couture. That's cute. Whatever. I only wear geese clothing. <laughs> or guess. What is it? Guess? It's like G U E S E or something like that. Or G U E S S? It's guess, Scotty. Geese clothing. <laughs> Hot so, water. Feather suits. Can I talk to this guy? LAPD. We're making inquiries into the whereabouts of an Albert Hammond. No one here by that name. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. This isn't the sort of place where people use their real names. Mm. Take a look at the register if you don't believe me. Oh, yes. <laughs> I didn't need that ping, but thanks. Okay. So look for prominent Tommies. That should narrow it down. Prominent Tommies. Orson Welles? <laughs> I do like that. Hedy Lamar? People are using celebrity names. Rita Your Hayworth? Anywhere? Shirley Temple? Ava Gardner? I'm sure these are all famous people and we just don't Go know Go to the other page. Them. Go to the other page. Winston Churchill, Humphrey Bogart, Bob Hope, Vivian Lee. Winston Churchill, very patriotic Englishman, is staying in room two hundred seven. Oh right, this guy's English. The old mm. bulldog. Even at a flop house, Adley can't get out from the shadow. 
What room was it? 207. Is that it? 107. <gasps> eh, eh. Well, no sign of a struggle. Except for the trash can being overturned, but... Looks like he's had a Got an address. Home soon. Your boy done good. He must be heading home. You know I hope he makes it. Get out. Press B. I have been pressing B. Liar. This is why I don't like playing. You're always, <laughs> you're always thinking. Of, you're always doubting me, doubting Thomas. There's his mouth guard. That's not really a clue. That just lets you know he was he. Wait, that means he kept his mouth guard in his mouth and then like all the way home and then spat it out. Or does it mean that he washed his mouth guard after having taken it out at the club, or not club, but the boxing arena? But then left it here, meaning there was no reason to wash it. That's weird. Eat this. Okay, so he was... I either brought a girl here, or it's just after Valentine's Day and it was a good deal because it was on sale. Mm-hmm. One or the other. Maybe they broke up. Mm. That, that looks like blood, man. No, it doesn't. Oh. I mean, it's red, so... It's just a color... Can I tap Filled this it out. thing? Candy has expensive. Candy. Taste. Albert has his work cut out for him. Was All that right. for the soup? The it was for the soup. Yeah. And Insta Heat. We <laughs> yeah. Who's Candy? Candy Who's Edwards. Candy? Lady who fell down oh, that room kind of stuck to you. I know it was weird. <laughs> I remember um, when the like Xbox. Homework. Was it the Xbox? Yeah, it was the Xbox 360 first came out. I think one of the first games we got on it was uh, me and my brother got Oblivion, you know, Elder Scrolls. And I remember the first, when you start playing the game, you start off playing in a uh, prison cell. So the first thing you do is you wake up and you're in this prison cell, and there are chains uh, hanging from the roof that you can, like, shackle people to, right? And I remember just, like, walking around into the chains over and over again, because it was the first time I played a game when the chains moved when you walked into them, <laughs> instead of you just clipping through them or something. Yeah. And I remember just doing that for, like, 15 minutes and really annoying my brother, because I was playing first and he wanted to play. And he was upset that I was playing and yeah, basically wasting my time. Yeah. That kind of reminds me how in, you can I think, in Bloodborne, like, your clothes really move a lot, huh? Yeah, and you just like to spin around sometimes. <laughs> Um, so you boxed what else? We all did. Standard training. I'm trying to Can't think. You ever played oh, that's what it was. I was playing uh, Elder Scrolls Online, and just every time I pass animals, I stop and look at them. <laughs> or I'll just ride horses, or I'll like run up to people and like check out what they're doing. Because I like looking what like just the world around you is doing, rather than just what like the actual objectives are. Because you know, I, I like seeing the things on the sides of the games. Can't really do that in Grand, Def Grand Theft Auto because that game's a fucking sham. Yeah, everything's empty. Um, Nothing is real. I mean, you can still find things though in that game, which is fun. Like you can find like little murals by uh, like street corners from like where people got hit by cars. And uh, sometimes the uh, billboards and things like that say things that are kind of silly. But um, Jonathan was remarking though that when he played uh, Elder Scrolls with Alice, who's four years old. That's what she would have him do. She kept telling him to look at all the doggies and check out what that guy's doing and why is this guy doing this and stuff like that. So I just play, I play like a child, I guess, is what John's saying. All these gentlemen callers. She said, uh, stairs? Yeah. So go back the way you came. She said it was on the outside. Yeah, go back the way you came and then turn left. So you want to go to the second floor? Oh, right. Yeah. And look for the gold knob. Seven. Yeah, right there. Oh, shit. Something's happening. Oh! Whoa! Oh, don't lose your hat. You lost your hat. This isn't going to end well for you, friend. Ooh, nice headbutt. I mean, actually, it wasn't. Like, if you actually wanted to headbutt someone in a fight, you wouldn't do, like, whip your head back and forth like that. Because that's going to give you whiplash and hurt your neck. Right. You would tuck your chin down into your chest and then basically use your body to hit them. Like a shark. You got a shark up. Oh, um, but breathing. You know? Give her a minute. Take a look around. Oh, man. She's, she's like, fucking knocked out. Yeah, she's... 
Wow. Yeah. That's not good. You gotta check his pockets. No, let's see how that arm's doing. How is that hand? <laughs> oh god, it's so dumb. Inside coat. It's always the left where they keep. Oh, I guess not. Whoa. Well, thank, thank. If you're primarily right-handed, it's easier to put it into the left side of your jacket. Right? Uh, yeah, but I guess as well it wasn't on that side. That's not a wallet. Whoa! All the Italians carry them. A real man uses his fists or a gun. What? Okay. Wait, what sense does that make? Also, I missed the stuff about the Italian guy. I was trying to pay attention, but you were talking to me about some bullshit. Well, you said it's always on the left, and I was like, well, if you're right-handed, you're That's not what I'm talking code. about. I'm talking about in the hotel lobby. What hotel lobby? This hotel lobby, when she was talking about the Italian guy. Oh, I wasn't paying attention to that at all. I don't think so. Cutlery. That looks like, like, medical tools. Are they I medical tools or maybe like a lock picking kit? Why would that Nail not polish? be important? Why would that kit not be important? I don't know. It seems like it would be important. Or is it makeup? It doesn't look like makeup. No, it was definitely not makeup. You don't use blades and makeup. Yeah. No, it was either. Man, I don't know. Single ticket. Candy oh Edwards. I guess there isn't a lot. There's no way her fucking real name is Candy. I know a few candies. Campers A to flip it over? No. No? Okay. I tried. Alright, so. Alright, let's wake up Sprout. Take a seat, Miss Edwards. We have some questions for you to answer. Look, I haven't done anything wrong. Ever? I find that pretty hard to believe. <laughs> this guy. Can you answer some questions now, Miss Edwards? Sure, I've had worse. I'll shake it off. Jeez. All right. We're trying to track down Albert Hammond. We have reason to believe he might be in danger. Do you know where he is? No, I don't. I'm over Albert. I haven't seen him. Oh, I'm going to doubt that shit. Telegram. Is she on the telegram? Elvira. What's it just then? Press, uh, Candy stop. Edwards. This is Candy Edwards. Mm-hmm. Okay. Can oh, the uh, the magazine coupon has her name on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were in his hotel room. He came back after the fight, and you weren't there. What happened? You can't prove that I was in the room. The magazine coupon. Yeah. How do you think we found you, there Candy? You, you wrote your name and address on a coupon. Look. Albert was supposed to take a fall. We were all supposed to make a little money out of it. But Albert got too goddamn stubborn. Said his pride was all he had left. So I told him, shove it. Let's see his pride keep him warm at night. So you walked out before the fight? Yes, I did. What's the problem? I didn't take anything. Do the names Harry, Mervyn, or Ray mean anything to you? Could be anybody. How the hell would I know? I would say doubt on this one. Because she's not smiling what she wa like she was when she was lying. No, now she is. So, do you know these names? Found in Hammond's locker. The only thing you can think of... What's the uh, Cunard association? No, okay. Um, I don't think we have anything. Yeah, I'd say that on. Give up oh, fuck. We'll think about letting these charges against you slide. What? Charges against me? All I did was try and look out for Albert. Now he skips out and I have to take beatings from him as well? Yeah. You're leaving town, Miss Edwards? Yes, I'm going straight home. Oh, are you? Because we don't believe you bus ticket? Or... But that's... The Cunard line? Maybe she's taking a... She's taking a cruise. Yeah, let's go with the Cunard line then. You're lying, Brian. Albert finally won a big fight. I say good luck to him. But you know where he is. Let me help me, Candy. Do all you have to run off the mouth? Prove I know where he is. Because it said coming home soon. 
If he lives in England, that means he's going on a boat, right? Yeah. Your boy done go good home soon, Albert. I do the Cunard Essentia. I mean, it's just an ad, but... Yeah. Yeah. If I did, I wouldn't tell you. Well, we fucked up. <sighs> Is there a way of just, we like, pressing start up. and going that back, like, wrong. just to the beginning of the conversation? A little more I don't know. Let me see. You better watch your backs. Like, if I say restart, that's gonna restart the whole thing, isn't it? Yeah. Ugh. Get out, Carlo. You oh, did you want to pull up a walkthrough into the walkthrough, or, or did you not want to do that? Yeah, I think I do. I'm tired of getting questions wrong. Okay. Shoot you like a dog. That bitch knows where Hammond is. She knows where my money's gone. My money too, tough guy. I'll handle this. It's called the setup, right? Yeah. Bad people are looking to hurt Candy, and yet she's not heading straight for the train station. I smell a payoff. I say stake her out. See where she goes. We were here all night. Were we here all don't fucking night? Away, but don't get Just jerking each other don't off. The car behind you. Just, just admiring each other's hats. Oh, I see. I'm having to follow her. I'm actually having a tailor, so I have to like look. Yeah. Incognito, unsuspicious. Yeah, real unsuspicious. List of odds recovered. Lie. Bookmakers payouts. Odds to loosen her lips. Plans to leave town is a doubt. Wow. Well, don't say it out loud. Just. No, but that was the one we just did. Yeah, that's I know. what I'm saying. I okay, was just wondering. Following her now. Focus camera. Wow, why is the pool empty? Did someone shit in the pool and they had to empty it to clean it? Yes. Man, this hotel sucks. You just have people shitting in pools. Or maybe they're actually like the first skateboarders. <laughs> and they're gonna be skating in that pool. That didn't happen until like the 60s or 70s, right? <gasps> what? She's right in front of me! What are you She's mean? looking at you. Oh, she's. Oh. I got too close. Mm hmm. Okay. Well then? She turned around and looked at you. Do you want to try following her? I'm not good at following. You can press A or whatever to skip that. So just press A to use the newspaper and then I guess not get too close. Maybe you can dodge behind the cars as well, like take cover. But I mean if she looks behind her and sees someone like dodging in out of cover, that does not look uh, normal, you know? Just because she ever like puts it down, remember she has a bright red bag. Mm -hmm. Like if she gets separated from her bag, you know which one to look for. I feel like I do have to take cover though, because it seems like she kind of like looks behind. Oh well. Yeah, there she turned around. Oh, you can take cover.
This is so, so exciting. Boring. Risk losing the trail. Don't get too close to her. I was getting too far away though. Where is she? Oh, well, it's blinking, so she's out of your sight. There she is. Oof. So how's your day then? Just this. Ate a bunch of pizza pillows. Yeah, pizza pills. Oh yes. Um. Sleep all right? I sleep. I slept for like eleven hours. I think. Yeah. You drink an energy drink and then crashed real fucking hard. Yeah, it was really weird. I. Okay, that was weird. Um. Crossing the street. You can just cross the street here. Just don't get hit by a car. Yeah, I know, right? So she's ducked over Going to that amber to this house. Eh. I didn't sleep so good. Really? I had to get out of bed uh, oh, twice right. to have like diarrhea and threw up twice. I had Taco Bell, and I think maybe it was bad. It tasted fine, but maybe it was bad. I can't think of anything else it would have been. I know. Because besides that, I drank, I drank some juice, but that juice we bought like two days ago, so I don't think that's bad. And it's not like an organic juice either. It's... Yeah, it's not like something. Yeah, it's sugar water. So yeah, I think. Uh, there's not like any way to speed this up. Ah! I feel like she was looking. I was a raccoon all the long. But <laughs> she didn't spot me. You're way too close. Yeah. Ah! You have to start the entire thing over. No, I was trying to take cover, and I ran too. F and I ran you too. You don't close. need to ever run up to her. I don't- I wasn't trying to run up to her! I was trying to run to cover! Don't run ever! If she gets too far away, I have to run to catch up with her. No you don't, you'll be fine. Yeah, or else I'll lose her. If you're too far away, just walking will be fast enough because eventually she'll stop moving. You have to be careful. She's looking now. Yeah. No, it's fine. I'm on the other side of that truck. She can't see me. Don't be a dickhead. Come on. You are being a pussyfoot. It's the most opposite of a dickhead you can get. Keep over by the cars. Don't get in... Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. In this side of the cars. <laughs> yeah. Just keep walking by the cars. And just take cover, like, right now. Nee. See, every time you it blinks on the map, it's because you can't see her. And I so don't you always need... need to see her. I just know, need to know what her general direction is. Wait. Much slack. See, and it kept telling me that. That's not too much slack. It's the appropriate amount of slack. I wonder if I can still that tricycle. You're getting too far. It's fine, I see her. I see where she is. Going into that alley, I want this tricycle. See, look, she's right there. You're making me nervous. Why? She's right there, I see her. All you have to know is like which direction she's gonna go. Is she gonna run? She's going right. So now I can go forward, because I'm out of her sight. And then I ran too far and she saw me, like, stop. Womp, 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 womp. Thrifty liquor. I looked at that walkthrough real fast. It didn't look like there's actually any other conversations in this game.
Wait, so I didn't need to follow her because now my partner's right here. There was no reason for me to have followed her. Okay, so I'm investigating yeah, thrifty still go into the store, though. Yeah. Here we are. Kick the door open. Man. I love it when he randomly kicks the door open for no reason. Said she was being watched. How much does she collect? Thirty-six hundred dollars. Jesus Christ! Out. On the Hammond Kid Galahad fight, you got it. I'm not complaining. You so all made a lot of money on that. Huge. She went the opposite Galahad, way. And then Hammond knocks the bum out. So she collected the money and went out through the back door. Nope. She made a phone call over there, wrote something on a notepad, and then left. Really? Because it doesn't seem like I was waiting outside that long for her to have done all of those things. Old intelligence, trick the Old intelligence trick? You mean really? a kindergarten trick, you fucking piece of shit? Examiner or something or other? Hollywood? Hollywood. It's not gonna let you have it until you get that the whole thing. Yeah, I'm trying to get the rest of that H. Like, I can't go any more in the corner, so I can't get more of the E. I have to go all the way down here. Like, I know what it says. Give me that. There. Okay, now it's fine. Where she's headed. Let's get Jesus. I had to fill in the rest of the little black spot over there where there was no writing, even. How dumb. Okay, let's go back here, then. Or should I question the... No, there's no reason to talk to him. Close up on the door. There's nothing. That's it. New location. Can you drive to this one? Do we know where we're going? Wonderful and fart noises made by Scotty. And candy is You know what? Sometimes you gotta let, let it all go. Let it go. Let it go. Is. is Candy collecting on Albert's behalf, or is she cheating him too? Car 11 K11 King, further to your request, Bunko Fraud has three known bookmakers operating out of storefronts in the Hollywood area. Thrifty Liquor, 6106 Santa Monica, the okay. Drugstore, and a Max Spirits at Is this like an immediate concern, or is it just telling me stuff? Mm. Mm. But the thing is, those are all, uh, those are all bookkeepers. Most likely she's going to all three of them and getting paid. Mm-hmm. The music started. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Saucy jazz time. Saucy was the exact word I was gonna say. All right, this is a drugstore. Let's get sauced. Gonna buy liquor in a drugstore. Get slithered. I like PD. Relax, Cole. You just have a blonde in here, Mervin. Sure did. Of course, he fucking knows who this guy is. Up. She took me to the cleaners. Four thousand clams and change. How long ago did you leave? Maybe five minutes. Call the cab. God, this guy's voice is terrible. Where's the phone? It's super smoky. In oh, here. is that the phone? Yeah. Right. Yellow cap. We need to get after her fast. Operator, give me R and I. Can you connect me to the Yellow Cab Company, Hollywood 2187, please? This is Detective Phelps, LAPD. You dispatched the cab to 1487 Ivar Avenue, Hollywood. Yes, sir. Send one round for the pool. Do you have the number of that cab? Number 1793. Thanks. Okay, so I'm looking for a Yellow Cab 179. No, I think you need to talk to the guy again. Eh. 
have any idea who Ray is? Sugar Ray. Not now, <laughs> Marvin. Cole doesn't have much of a sense of humor at the best of times. Ray runs a shop up on he North just Jersey wants to fly, Adam. that's all. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where's your car? There's your car. I found a car. Jesus Christ, Scott. I'm like a puppy. Drive. God. Where are we going? I think you have to drive. This fraud's planning on cleaning out every bookmaker in town. Hammond needed to make sure he was getting a bigger payday than if he'd taken the flop. Never trust the limeys, especially where a fight's concerned. A mistake Jeez. To stop making. What's happening with the back of this car? I don't know. Did you see that? Did you see that? I was paying attention to him. What was it? It looked like the back of the cars like was clipping through the oh, the convertible cloth thing though that's number one two three four so that's not the right cab that's the cab what was it, it was like one two seven or one seven eight one seven two don't get too close she must be inside no i guess one two three four was it well, whatever no it was one two seven or one two nine or something this is one two three four but she's getting into it we're on the move again, Cole. After her. Don't lose that cab. Well, my Emma is over the hill. It, it's a punching bag for the up-and-comers. She knows goddamn place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place isn't L.A. He's punchy. His brain's going to mush. Winston Churchill? Give me a break. Churchill is a fighter, boy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could These think of. These types of missions always make me so nervous. I like it your partner's like, oh, you can never trust the limes, especially in a fight. He's mad at this guy for cheating people who were trying to cheat. Doesn't that seem like it's just like you got a pretty funny idea of what not surprising? Profile means, Phelps. Go. Well, I want to give some space, some slack, because I don't know if she's going to have to stop right around that corner because there's going to be cars there or not. I don't want to get like trapped in a position when I end up getting real close to her and not being able to like really change it. Right? All right. Okay. I see what's going on. I see it. There you are. Yeah, red lights don't matter to me. Is she, is she stopping? Can I stop? I'm gonna stop. Stay over here. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. I don't understand why I'm so nervous. Because, you know, if you fuck up, you have to start the whole thing over again. It's a huge waste of time. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay, they're turning. Going now. Oh, God, I don't want to watch this. <laughs> <laughs> I really hate this. Really? Yeah. That bitch is giving it's not a big me deal. That's it's fine. It's all good. Look, my heart look. rate is like beating. She's turning right. No big deal. I'm gonna turn right. I don't want to watch this. I'm not watching this. Okay. Just tell me when it's over. It's over. Oh, we got a little close to her. Okay, we're turning left. I hit a car, but it's all good. It's all okay. <laughs> she turned right, and there's cars in front of me. So I'm having trouble keeping up, but it's okay. I just had to hit them out of the way. There she is. She stopped at a red light now. Oh, God! I have time to Stop. catch up. <laughs> Stop telling me what's happening. I don't even want to think about it. Okay. Oh, it's over. Pull over. She's heading inside. She's heading inside of a building. It's a bus stop. It's a bus station. <sighs> We're on foot. I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tell Feeling lightheaded. Okay, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hey girl, what's up? What the fuck? What the fuck? I didn't realize I was still telling her. I thought I was gonna confront what her. What is your problem? I thought I was confronting her. No! I thought No! It's cool though. It's fine, look, we're right here, it's fine. Okay, I'm not I'm not I'm still not watching. So what, should I go in and just like duck here? Like this? Is that good? 
I don't know because. Okay, so she's moving. Okay, let's go. Can I? Ooh, can I sit here? Just this newspaper? That works. What? <laughs> I was uncalled for. What a sour man. Don't mind me. Shut the fuck up. What? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, shit. So she got shot. No one else was in here. She must have got shot from a windowsill? The fuck happened? <laughs> was he waiting for her in the girl's bathroom? Just try and sit still, Candy. Who shot you? Was it Albert? God. <gasps> no, 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 she's gonna die. She fucking is dead now. I have a patrolman searching the depot. The yeah, so I must have shot her from the window. He got the money, right? Looks like it. A tough bird, our limey friend. Using his girlfriend as the bag woman and then getting greedy over the split. He won't make it out of town. That's how you see it? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. Oh my god. Here's what I'm confused She's by. She's for sure dead. The bathroom stall door was closed. So if he shot her from inside, she fell backwards onto the toilet, and then the, it closed just by itself? Like, what the fuck? I'm not sure. Wait, the gun's here. She had a gun. She must have met him inside of the bathroom. One bullet gone, or is it... One shot yeah, one fire. bullet's missing. So that's the murder weapon? Why would the murder weapon still be here unless she shot herself? Which, I mean, if she shot herself, I don't think she would have shot herself in the chest. No, that would have been hard to maneuver. Well, Are you sure just... that's it for that purse? So yeah, you open the purse and automatically just took the card out. Either, I guess. We don't have much left to go on. Hmm. No tire tracks on the floor. Check if that's everything. Yeah. yeah. Alright, well... To the car. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Poor girl. She didn't deserve that. Poor girl. Half the precinct aren't taking a vacation this year because of her. You need to leave town a lot quicker than that if you decide to screw over Mickey C. Yikes. How come he knows all these people? Because he's fucking a douche. Like, he needs to be arrested. He's clearly, like, doing illegal shit. Yeah. Okay, well, something's happening in here. That car's just parked with the door still open. Aren't they all? Car 11 King, Car 11 King, come in. Car 11 King, message from the coroner. The cause of death was a knife wound. Repeat, a knife wound. The revolver appears to have belonged to the victim. Casey yeah, okay. I was wondering where the gun would still be there. Real men use their fists, not guns. That guinea cocksucker. You think he got the money too? Come on, Roy. We're bringing this whole tragedy to its conclusion. That uh, uh, Italian guy had a switchblade. Yeah, so he stabbed her and she shot, either missing him. Yeah, she must have missed him because there wasn't any other blood inside the place. Um, you're talking. She was running out on me. And you were gonna let her? No, I let her collect. I set her up just like she set me up. Just like my manager set me up. Everyone wanted me to take the dive. 
Everyone wanted me to take the short money. It's for the best. You were washed up, kid. You couldn't climb, and you were too brave to sink. You were going nowhere. Maybe, but I had heart. I was a Royal Marine, Carlo. If I lost the fight, it wasn't for lack of trying, and it wasn't for lack of courage. I didn't have much, but I had that. I did it for you, and that's how you repay me! You did it for yourself. So did little boy. You did it and made a quick buck. Candy did it and make those green come true. Blah, blah, blah. I've got the money. All I need to do is get rid of you. It's going to be a shame, kid, but that's business. Technically, the boxer hasn't done anything illegal. No. Well, except for placing a bet on himself. I don't think you're allowed to do that. Mm-hmm. But technically, it was Candy placing the bet, so... Right. Like, he didn't throw the fight. He won. So... Enough, mm -hmm. Put down your weapon. You're making a big mistake, Arcaro. Bitch. Ran away just like a coward. Okay, I got that guy. There's someone else over here. Throw out the guns. There was another guy over there, right? Yes. Okay, he went upstairs. Oh. I did it! But there's still someone up here. Did I get him? No. Get him that time? No. Am I hitting the bar or am I hitting him? Is he on the middle? Yes. Okay, where's he going? Further back. He's probably going in here. Yeah, he's coming around over this yeah. side. Is this a movie theater or like a stage play? It's a, it's a movie theater. A lot of effort for... This dot went away. Oh, shit. Whoa. Okay. All right. Time to come out now, Hammond. Put the gun down, Roy. That son of a bitch owes me a lot of money. Shut up. Catch. He put $50 on the fight. He stole 2000 yesterday. I know. Jesus. Because I was a Marine, and I once lacked courage. Everyone deserves a second chance. Now beat it. Why, I'm just letting him go? He didn't do anything illegal. Um. Fuck you! That English prick is getting away with my money, Phelps! I think your partner does cocaine. I'm here he seems like a cokehead to me, doesn't he? Yeah. Of gangsters looking to get square, that LAPD cops might be involved. Either of you two sons of bitches know anything about that? No, sir. So, the dead wop who turned up in this theater, who used to be a boxing manager, who murdered Candy Edwards, has nothing to do with the fix? Absolutely not. Earl, you're doing venereal disease citations until you can learn to stop lying to me. Phelps? Got anything to add? Ah. Uh, no, sir. Get what? your uniform from your locker. You're back on the street. So this is how he gets demoted? In all fairness, um, should have handled that differently. I know. <laughs> One, One star. star. I found every clue. I just got two questions wrong. Maybe she didn't have to die. Oh, yeah, with Candy headed back to the moor. So I was probably too slow to go into the bathroom. If it went in faster, maybe I would have just seen the guy run out of the, run out of the window and I would chase after him or something. Uh huh. Well. Shit, boy. Should be cray. Well. We or maybe you can't do anything but get one star because the whole thing is you get demoted, so you don't do it well. Mm. Yeah, I guess so. Whatever. Hey, it's Bennett. It has been an episode. A full, a full time, a full thing. Oh full time. yes. Yeah. All right. See you later. Want to do another one?